Greetings, my name is Ahmed al Dinal Dafrawi, and I'm presenting Learning Languages Through Digital Platforms, a part of the course for digital culture. Thanks to digital platforms, nowadays more people are learning languages and sharing their experiences on the internet. I am still visiting in the Los Angeles for the time of vacation. Of the most popular language platforms, Rosetta Stone, which uses language immersion, text, images without translation. Rosetta Stone is probably the most popular language software program out in the world right now. Ella está nadando? Rosetta Stone also uses distant learning through internet courses. Also, it has applications which can be used on smartphones and tablets. And they pitch that they have uh, State Department, government agencies use them and it is the best way to learn a language. Duolingo is another important language platform that teaches also constructed languages. Duolingo teaches you to read, write, listen, and speak. And it's extremely effective. In fact, an independent study found that 34 hours on Duolingo are equal to a whole university semester. A semester of knowledge that you can fit into your breaks, commutes, and moments spent waiting in line. Babel is also another platform. It has an application that you could use on your mobile phone or tablet. It's a bit similar to Duolingo, but advertised as more effective. Brad Martin, who learned Arabic through Rosetta Stone and he was sharing with us his opinions about Donald Trump. Du bist ja ein Experte, du sprichst sechs Sprachen, richtig? Richtig, genau. Und die meisten davon hast du über Musik gelernt? Gerade genau, ja. Polyglots, which is people who speak too many languages, have been also creative in using other methods, like programs from the internet to slow down the audio, and also through music. Audacity, download, and with that you can hear the music slowly, and then it will be easier to the text, the words, and everything, and the language better learn and better use and train. Comments on the video include, apparently this song is the official learning German song. I have watched Französisch für Anfänger when I learned Deutsch in my school and this music is very cute. Ich bin Französisch. These comments have more than 40 replies. There is also another comment like, today is my first day I've learned German and this is my first German song and so on and on and on. Digital platforms have been also used among immigrants and people who want to integrate in the newer society. And that's why there were programs which were made exclusively for immigrants. And in the native language, for all proficiency levels. Aber jetzt, nachdem ich nach Deutschland gekommen bin und dann hatte ich so viele Kontakt mit Deutschen und so, habe ich, hab ich gemerkt, das ist ganz anders. Die sind Menschen wie uns und jede Gesellschaft eigentlich, die sind... Danke. Ja, Karina, du äh, bist wie uns, Karina. Okay. <lacht> und schreibt uns mal bitte eure Frage für heute. Schreibt uns in die Kommentare, wie habt ihr Deutsch gelernt oder wie lernt ihr Deutsch? That means the cat was eaten by a fish. So a Chinese speaker reading these sentences would get the core meaning of the Chinese characters, but they would miss some meaning in the inflection. So imagine you're an English speaker reading something with English loanwords. It might look something like this. Cat blah, fish blah, food blah blah. This tone has become synonymous with language learning. In fact, in February, the Huffington Post made an article about a spoof Trumpese course, 
which Rosetta Stone shared on its Facebook page. To help people learn Trumpies, uh, take a listen to it. Rosetta Stone, Trumpies, lesson three. Hello, it's nice to meet you. Hello, it's nice to meet me. Seven people came to my party. Eighty billion people came to my party and we were lining up at 4 a.m. However, Rosetta Stone does not use translation to teach you a language. Instead, they use immersion. And there's another spoof for Rosetta Stone, which was for finding Dory. On the whale language, Ellen DeGeneres. You learn why whales often called the romance language. Computer says no. But of course, digital platforms aren't without their mistakes and errors. You notice that the guy actually pronounced it Aman, which is a, a mistake. It's written Senna, and he pronounces it Aman. Yes, it does work okay, but probably not as good as you are hoping. And that's only if you finish the entire program, and you probably won't finish the entire program. No. What are some of the uh, disadvantages, at least, that I see about Duolingo? Well, first one, you know, uh, if you're really serious about learning the language, <clears throat> I think that Duolingo is one uh, tool that you can have in your arsenal, but it's definitely not going to make you, you know, basically absolutely fluent in the language if that's all you do. Video blogs about languages have also promoted each other and also their sponsors. Here könnt ihr GLS mal auf ein Video draufklicken und den Kanal solltet ihr unbedingt abonnieren. How to learn German faster? Yeah, so all meine Tipps aus 17 Jahren Arbeit Erfahrung sind in diesem schönen Buch. Perfekt. Also guckt vorbei smartergerman.com. Also besser als unsere Website mimicmethod.com. M i m i c method.com. Und dort haben wir viele kostenlose Kurse für Aussprachen zu lernen, viele Musik und alles auf Deutsch auch. auch. Learning a language? Und, ja. Have a look at our partner website italki, where you can meet language exchange partners for free or learn at home with convenient online lessons. Werdet ein Patron und bekommt Übungen noch zu dieser Episode. Um, wir freuen uns, dass ihr dabei wart. Thanks again to all my Patreon supporters and I want to say thanks to all the new subscribers who joined this month. There are a lot of you and you are very welcome and very appreciated. Ich mag dich. Ich mag dich. I like dick! Digital platforms have also concentrated <laughs> on flirting. Uh, like the example of Babel. And also Duolingo. <laughs> and in this Italian course, do you have a map? I'm lost in your eyes. Hai una mappa? Mi sono perso nei tuoi occhi. You are boring. That doesn't sound like something you would say in flirting. But and don't forget. Safe sex. Sex the tour. Have fun. Bye. Je ne suis pas fier de sa vie qui veut me tuer. C'est magnifique être sympathique, mais je ne le connais jamais. Je ne veux